Andre, welcome to Watford. Um, tell us about the last few hours. I guess it's been a bit of a whirlwind since, what, last night? Yeah, um, I ain't really had time to think. Um, got the call pretty late last night and um, just packed my bags and left, really. Um, did you say you didn't have too much time to think? Easy decision then to come down here? Yeah, definitely. Um, it was, uh, like I said, it happened quite quickly and um, yeah, it was, it was, it was easy. Um, Pretty much a no-brainer. So, um, it's well documented. Burnley certainly didn't want to sell you. So, um, what's your motivation to come here? What, why so keen to come to Watford? Um, it's, it's obviously a great club, and um, it's got it's got a big future. And um, I had a fantastic time at, at Burnley, and um, being there, I achieved my dream of playing in the Premier League. And um, we stayed up last season as well. So I feel like um, I need a new challenge. I feel like I've done. Done my job, job there in the, in the two seasons. I, two seasons I've been there, so um, it was a fresh challenge. And um, obviously, speaking to the club was um, something that excited me and um, made me want to come here. You're right. I mean, it, it was a fantastic season for, for Burnley last season. Um, how much that has whetted your appetite to get that taste of the Premier League and do so well as well to then kick on again in year two? Yeah, exactly. And um, I've got, still got a lot to learn. So, um, like I said, I'm. Um, I feel like a, a new challenge was, was came at the right time and um, no better place than Watford. Tell us about you. Um, what do you see as your, your, your main attributes? What can you add to this Watford team? Um, I think if people have seen me play, that it's probably my most notable attribute would be my, my pace and um, seem to be able to find the net at times. And um, hopefully I can do it a lot more than I did last season. So. Um, you're attacking off camera. You, you know Troy, someone that you. You could be challenged for a place with or play alongside. How, how exciting could that be? Yeah, definitely. Um, we've, we've both come from similar backgrounds and um, worked our way up through the leagues. And um, he, he came came to the Prem, I think, two seasons before I did. And um, he's gone on to do how well he's done. So um, hopefully, yeah, we can um, strike up a partnership. And um, it's, it's a good health competition as well. You, you mentioned sort of similar backgrounds. Does, We've probably asked this of other players before. Does that make you, George? Do you feel as if you're probably even more hungry because you've sort of you've worked your way up through the ranks, through the clubs, through the leagues to get this chance in the Premier League? Yeah, definitely. And um, don't feel like I, I fully proved myself last season, but um, at times I feel like I did. So um, it's just I'm, I'm hungrier now to be more successful and um, be be a lot better than I was last year. So. Um, yeah, it, is, it does come from where I've come from, uh, the hunger does come from. Come from. So, um, yeah, hopefully it's, it's, it starts here. Yeah. Um, club record fee, the transfer for you to come here, a burden or an inspiration? Inspiration. Um, I think um, every player will tell you it's not, it's not down to them what the, what the price is, but um, I suppose it's, it's, it's down to me to, to justify that and um, I'm ready for the challenge ahead. And, um, yeah, I don't see it as a burden. It's like you said, it's, it's inspiration for me to um, go and prove my worth. The squad sort of being reshaped here, and there's a number of homegrown British players yeah. and a real, real core developing here at Watford now. I know you won't have had a chance to, to meet the, the lads yet, but the signings like Nathaniel Chalabar and Will Hughes and Tom Cleverley, along with the lads that are already here, it's that real core that, that know what this league's about. How, how will that make to sort of join a new club a little bit easier for you? Yeah, it's vital. Um, Obviously, coming coming from Burnley, that's what it was. It was a, was a lot of homegrown, um, but um, yeah, and it is vital in the Premier League to, um, especially on them them horrible nights that you need to grit your teeth and um, get through games uh, by any means necessary. So um, it's obviously just it just shows where the, the direction of the club where it's going and um, what they're trying to achieve. So. Just give me my next question. Am ambition here. Our ambitions are obviously, you know, lofty. And, and with the calibre of player like yourself coming in, just just what is achievable now at Watford? Do you think? Um, anything is possible. Um, I genuinely believe that. Um, I think always going to end up going back to saying, but what Leicester did over the years, it shows you. And as you can see on paper, the, the quality in, in this team is is, is there. So um, it's, it's just down to down to the team now to to prove. To prove where how far we can go. So. You're obviously done pre-season with Burnley, so you're fit and raring to go. And 
nice little appetizer on, on Saturday with, with Liverpool at Vicarage Road. That would be a bad, uh, bad time to make your debut in, in front of the home fans. Yeah, exactly. It's been um, a long pre season, they always are. So um, it was good to get this done before, before the season started. So um, yeah, I'm ready to go and um, hopefully I can make my debut Saturday.